написать цель уничтожена цель. обнаружено отрудие запишите координаты да, готов. 35 вижу попадание попадание рядом 50 метров 50 метров орудие раскрыло есть повреждения как принял есть разрыв орудие выстрел координаты 24 420 Выстрел! 51,80, да. Орудие! Выстрел! Central MD's D-30 crews organize artillery raid on AFU field stronghold. Having received data from forward reconnaissance units, servicemen arrived at positions and hit a carefully camouflaged field stronghold of Ukrainian nationalists, forcing the enemy to leave the occupied area. The fire was adjusted directly on the line of contact with the help of reconnaissance and small unmanned aerial vehicles. The Central Military District's artillerymen note the high efficiency of the D-30 howitzer due to its high accuracy, high rate of fire, and the possibility of all-around fire. In Kupiansk direction, units of the Zapad group of forces supported by aviation and artillery repellinate attacks of the AFU 32nd, 57th, and 67th mechanized brigades near Sinkovka and Zagorykovka. In the course of the counter-battery warfare, three Polish-made crab self-propelled artillery systems, two Gvozdika self-propelled artillery systems, and one Grad MLRS were neutralized. 
Ukrainian armed forces use mercenaries to shoot at Ukrainian conscripts leaving their positions. Georgian citizen Georgi Goglid says that FU paid him $300 for each killed Russian serviceman. Russian defense ministry shows Western MD's giants and S. Howitzer crews in Kupiansk direction. Ivanovo-based airborne troops assault detachment in western flank of Artyomov's direction. Su-25 aircraft in Donetsk direction in action during the special military operation. Flamethrower units of the nuclear, chemical, and biological protection Troops Regiment of the Combined Arms Army of the Western Military District underwent training in Leningrad region. AFUPOW speak about demoralization in Ukrainian army. The armed forces of the Russian Federation continue the special military operation. In Kupiansk direction, units of the Zapad Group of Forces, supported by aviation and artillery, have repelled two attacks by assault groups of the 57th Mechanized Brigade of the AFU close to Sinkovka. The enemy losses were up to 30 servicemen, one tank, two pickup trucks. During the counter-battery warfare, one M777 artillery system and one M114 howitzer manufactured by the U.S., one G. Bostica self-propelled artillery system, one D-20 gun, as well as one U.S. manufactured N TPQ-50 counter-battery radar, one ammunition depot of the 1st Special Purpose Brigade of the AFU has been destroyed near Volchansk. In Krasny Lemon direction units of the Center Group of Forces, helicopters, and artillery have repelled three attacks by assault groups of the 12th Special Purpose Brigade of the Armed Forces of Ukraine and the 5th Brigade of the National Guard close to Grigorovka and Serebryanka. The enemy losses were up to 180 servicemen, two motor vehicles, Akatsia and Jivostika self-propelled artillery systems. In Donetsk direction, units of the Yug Group of Forces, in cooperation with aviation and artillery, have eliminated enemy manpower and hardware near Razdalovka, Andrivka, Kleshivka, Nikolaevka, and Kurdyumovka. The enemy losses were up to 220 military personnel one tank, and seven motor vehicles. In addition, during the counter-battery warfare, French-manufactured Kizar and Polish-manufactured Krab self-propelled artillery systems, two M. Stabi howitzers, as well as one Mount 12 cannon have been destroyed. In South Donetsk direction, units of the Vostok Group of Forces, in cooperation with helicopters and artillery, have inflicted fire damage on manpower and hardware concentration areas of the 72nd Mechanized Brigade of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, 102nd and 127th Territorial Defense Brigades near Ugledar, Ravnopol, and Chervinoy. The enemy losses were up to 140 soldiers, two armored fighting vehicles, three motor vehicles. During the counter-battery warfare, one M109 Paladin self-propelled artillery system and one M777 artillery system manufactured by the U.S., one Jayatsin S self-propelled gun, two D-20 howitzers, as well as one Mount-12 cannon have been destroyed. In Zaporozhye direction, units of the Russian Group of Forces, Aviation, and Artillery have repelled one attack of an assault group of the armed forces of Ukraine and inflicted a fire damage on manpower and hardware concentration areas of the 33rd Mechanized Brigade of the Armed Forces of Ukraine near Rabatino. The enemy losses were over 40 servicemen, three pickup trucks, as well as one U.S. manufactured M119 howitzer. In Kherson direction, the enemy losses were over 60 servicemen and three motor vehicles. In addition, during the counter-battery warfare, one M. Stabi howitzer, 2D-30 Howitzers, as well as one Cobra counter battery radar station, have been destroyed. Operational, tactical, and army aviation, unmanned aerial vehicles, missile troops, and artillery of the armed forces of the Russian Federation have neutralized manpower and military hardware in 145 areas. In addition, one radar station of the S 300 surface to air missile system, as well as three control points of the 67th Mechanized Brigade of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, the 31st Operational Brigade, and the 50th Regiment of the National. National Guard have been hit near Sarabrianka. Air defense facilities have shot down one MiG-29 aircraft of the Ukrainian Air Force near Pavlograd. Seven HIMARS multiple launch rocket system projectiles have also been intercepted. In addition, 30 Ukrainian unmanned aerial vehicles have been hit close to Tokarevka, Svetovo, Kolomichika, Vasilyovka, Belogorovka, Kirilovka, and Romanovskoy. In total, 535 airplanes and 254 helicopters, 8,934 unmanned aerial vehicles, 441 air defense missile systems, 13,396 tanks and other armored fighting vehicles, 1,184 fighting vehicles equipped with MLRS, 7,100 105 field artillery cannons and mortars, as well as 15,273 special military motor vehicles have been destroyed during the special military operation.